Next morning, I get to school, and I see him walk down the hall. And guess who he's wearing? My and I'm saying, boy, he made them shoes look good. I did not look that fly. I look fly when I wear those, right? And so he walked down. I said, man, good to see you, buddy. Made them look good. And we go to class. Later that day, my favorite hour came, which was lunch break. I, I believed in lunch break. I believe, I don't know why kids don't eat lunch at school anymore. I used to live for lunch break. Any rate, so after I eat lunch, I leave the cafeteria and I'm walking through the quadrangle and I go to the area where me and my friends would hang out and talk and look. You can't say when you get home. So, so, so when I get there, I notice that my friend is not there. That's interesting. So I take a walk. And I go to it because sometimes people play basketball during lunch break. I walk, and there outside, on the concrete, running up and down the court, was my friend. I could care less about him playing basketball outside. The problem was he was wearing I said, stop the madness. <laughs> I go on a course and say, 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 bro, come here. I, I need a word. I said, I don't even wear those outside. What makes you think it's okay for you to wear <laughs> on this concrete? <laughs> this brother looks at me confused and somewhat bewildered and a tad bit agitated that I would have the audacity to question where he was wearing my shoes. I had to explain to him in, in very good English that I just let you wear them. I never gave them to you. They were always belonging to me. So as long as they belong to me, I get to dictate how you use what's mine. Never think that what God gave you is ever yours to do with how you please. You must honor the one who gave it to you and understand it's not mine. So I must be a good steward. And so here we have Jeremiah at the potter's house. Now, don't think for one second that this is Jeremiah's first time seeing this potter's house. Potter, pottery making was, was, was a big industry during this time period. It was, so Jeremiah probably passed this potter's house a million times. But this time, God would use something that he's familiar with to give him a whole new revelation. God would give him new eyes towards something old. I won't go.